Basically, I felt like I was coming out of my shoes. J.D. got the shock of his life Sunday after he says a downed power line hit the trailer on his truck and sparked a fire. The first thing I wanted to do is get remove the actual truck from the trailer and I reached underneath the trailer, grabbed the, grabbed the release handle and it sent me about 15, 20 feet. I hit the trailer next to me. Jolted feet into the air, J.D. says the shock didn't stop there. After I hit that trailer, I hit the ground. I spun about three, four times on the ground, just all electrified and got back up. And I was like, holy crap. He says he immediately warned other truck drivers that the wire was dangling across their trailers too, causing other trailers to catch fire and several truck tires to blow out. Council Bluffs Fire and Police had to block off the area for hours and wait for Mid-America to remove the wire as all the drivers remained cautiously inside. An employee with Mid-America tells me the strong winds brought the wires down on top of the trucks and the truck drivers did exactly what they were supposed to do in that situation, stay inside the trucks until they were able to get here and then de-energize the wires. Otherwise, someone else may have gotten hurt. J.D. refused to go to the hospital, but he did get his vitals checked out by an ambulance, and he says he's okay, but he admits. About the hardest hit I've ever had. With photographer Phil Hassenkamp, Lena Tillette, WOWT 6 News.